Parasitic infection from so-called kissing bugs has made its way to California and is causing some concern. The infection is spreading in several ways, mainly through those bugs, and can cause chronic problems. Circle of Health reporter Denise Sador is in studio and has more on the Chagas disease and what you need to know about. It. All right, guys, we've got some breaking news. Chagas disease, a silent parasite infection, is quietly becoming a healthcare crisis in the U.S. and could not be endemic in some areas. Now imagine you're asleep and a bug sneaks in, bites you on the face, and uh, years later you end up with heart failure, or even your intestines and esophagus so enlarged that you can eat or go to the bathroom. I know it sounds like a horror movie, but this is real. It's called Chagas disease, and it's caused by a parasite spread by the so-called kissing bug. Cute name, but trust me, you don't want this kiss. And while it's been endemic to uh, South America for decades, it's quietly becoming a healthcare crisis here in the U.S. right now. Here's the scale. About 300,000 people in the U.S. already have Chagas disease. California alone is estimated to have between 70,000 and 100,000 cases. Texas, Florida, and New York are also hotspots, each with tens of thousands of cases. Now, every year, roughly 10,000 new infections are thought to occur across the Americas. The tricky part about this disease is that early symptoms are easy to miss. Fever, fatigue, body aches, maybe swelling around your eyes, feels like the flu. And then the parasite hides out in your body for years. Fast forward 10 to 20 years later, and that's when the real damage shows up. We're talking heart problems like arrhythmias and uh, heart failure, or even sudden death. Or you can experience some digestive problems like megacolon and uh, an enlarged esophagus, conditions that could be devastating. And here's why public health experts are sounding the alarm. Chagas isn't just an imported disease anymore. The bug that spreads it lives across the Americas, including the southern United States, which means local transmission is possible. If it becomes endemic, thousands more people are at risk. Uh, but the good news, guys, is that if you catch it early, it's treatable. A simple blood test can make all the difference. So no need to panic, guys, but don't ignore it either. Awareness is protection because not every kiss is sweet. And this one can break your heart and your gut. Dr. Kwanji, your hero, I love you guys.